What's up with y'all? What's up with y'all? Welcome back to Moxie Approved. Minister Farrakhan has finally released a speech about the whole Kanye Kyrie situation. Uh, before we go to this video though, please do me a small favor, hit that like button. Make sure you got that notification bell turned all the way up to all. And if you haven't yet, please apply pressure to that subscribe button. Apply pressure to that subscribe button. Run the tape. Kyrie Irving and another brother who is called a rapper, but he's so much more than that. Uh, Brother Ye, and the controversy that is swirling around these two men that is causing, unfortunately, division among a people that can least afford to be broken more apart because of misunderstanding and unfortunately parts of ignorance that we don't see the enemy who is working 100% to bring bloodshed about among us because of the serious nature of what is happening that is causing them, the enemy, to use his influence on those of us who are on his payroll and those of us who have been blessed to be connected to them could be a blessing, but it also can be a cursing. Because once the enemy puts his talons into you, He's reaching for your mind, but more than that, he's reaching for your soul to empty us and make us weak when we could be strong and doing his bidding rather than manifesting the great love that God wants us to show toward one another. I'd like to start with Brother Kyrie. What did he do wrong? What did he do? He's searching for the knowledge of himself. He's searching to know who he is, who he belongs to. What is his root in this world? And some of you that are persecuting him are the very ones that took away from him and from us the knowledge of self. You took our language. You took our culture. You took our history. You took our minds and inserted your mind into our mind through your systems. And now God has come to lift us from this terrible condition that you have placed us in. So he saw a movie. He didn't write the movie. He wasn't the producer of the movie. He wasn't the director of the movie. Somebody told him that there was a movie 
titled From Hebrews to Negroes. That's an interesting title because many of our people don't know anything about being a, he a Hebrew. We know that we pass through something called Negro, and the Honorable Elijah Muhammad told us that means someone dead, lifeless, hard, neutral. We didn't name ourselves Newt, a Negro. They named us that because they put us in the condition that that name represents. Kyrie and Ye and all of you now that are involved in the conversation. Could you just step back a moment and let's reason together. He saw the movie. Yeah, as you heard, very powerful statements from the man himself, Minister Farrakhan, but there was a part of this video that uh, I paid extra close attention to. Minister Farrakhan actually gave out a short, brief description of his experience watching the movie Hebrews to Negroes. Let's go to that. Because of all of the anger and dislike and breaking apart, I, I said, let me see this movie. And I and my wife and my family we watched the movie the other night. It was well researched. The people that did it, they had a purpose. The purpose of those people was to show us how we got from Hebrew to Negro. As I watched that, I could see my brother, he's not thinking about hating somebody. He's thinking about learning more about himself because we are tired of being what others have made us. We must become ourselves again. You called it what? A, a, a anti-Semitic trope. The movie is almost a little over two hours. I'm sure there are things in there that you didn't like. <clears throat> but there are many things that you all have written about us that we don't like. So look, I just wanted to put out portions of this video because I think that you should click the link in the description to the original video and watch the full speech that Minister Farrakhan has given on this topic. He's been a part of this community for a while, whether you agree with him or if you don't. Tell me in the comment section what you thought about this speech by Minister Farrakhan. You know, he is Islam. So tell me what y'all think about this speech in the comment section. All right, Moxie out.